In a classroom turned medical training ground on the fourth floor at Dunbar High School, what would you do? what's your next step? Is where you'll find more than a dozen students explaining what they are learning about saving lives. That's our wound, and he got a wound on his neck on the other side. Everything that we learn in this class, we could use like everyday life. Definitely, for the city that we live in, is very bad. So we can kind of use this to help save lives. So I'm going to take my piece of dressing. I'm going to clean it off. The EMT class is taught by Venetia Roberts, who has more than two decades of experience as a paramedic on the streets of Baltimore City. She believes in what she's teaching. And on the side, we can get at least three providers, and then the top is the captain seat. It makes it relatable to life, so they're not just here to do something to pass a test or to graduate, but they could really save a life. If someone needed CPR, if someone needed to stop bleeding, they are life skills that they can take with them. 278, 29, 30. Took the head back. These students, now seniors, have been a part of the Dunbar EMT program since 10th grade. What do you like most about this? It's fun, it's interesting. I think everything about it is fun. Every skill we learn, everything we are taught, everything. I just like learning about it. Learning they're confident will pay off in the future. The opportunities are endless. The city's fire department, which supports EMT training classes in four high schools, believes students already have the skills necessary to land jobs. We know that they are capable of um, obtaining the certification, the coursework to do so, but then more importantly, we are incredibly confident that they have what it takes to serve the city of Baltimore. Now, as seniors, these students can graduate with medical knowledge and plenty of options, career options, beyond high school. At Dunbar High School, Tim Tooten, WBAL-TV 11 News.